You know, the pandemic changed so many things. Many of us, of course, spend more time at home. We also order more takeout. It's convenient, right? But it's also leaving more trash. Solid waste crews in San Antonio see it every day firsthand. They spoke with the night team's Patty Santos, who explains how all of that extra junk is causing real problems. We're seeing a lot more uh, food waste. We're seeing a lot more takeout containers. It's the COVID era trash surge. Biomedical waste such as masks, gloves and other one time use plastic. It's taking up more space on Earth. You put something in a landfill 100 years from now, it's still going to be there. Josephine Valencia, deputy director with Solid Waste, says the problem has only gotten worse. From 2019 to today, our population went up by about 3 percent. However, the amount of trash that we pick up went up by 9 percent. So the amount of trash that we are collecting uh, is increasing higher than our population rate. In 2018, a San Antonio household was throwing away 1.06 tons of trash a year. That's up to 1.12 tons now. It costs the city about $28 a ton. We're looking at probably about 50 years of landfill space in San Antonio. Solid waste only handles residential waste, but there's been an ongoing push to educate the public on how to compost, recycle and reduce trash. So stop waste before it starts. You know, really think about what you're buying. Do, do, you, really need, do you really need to buy that? Here's a simple way to remember it. If your trash can be eaten by worms like your leftover banana peel, well, that goes in green where it can turn into compost. If you have milk jugs, cans, bottles, that goes in blue. Patty Santos, KSAT 12 News.